In the Riverland, it's an irrigated horticultural region. Water is a major production cost. They are very concerned about using that water as efficiently as possible. Scheduling irrigation is a major challenge. Almonds are deciduous, and so there's a period where water requirements increase pretty rapidly because you're going from no water requirement with no leaves to maximum leaf area. It's around putting the right amount of water on at the right time to meet the tree's needs. There's a range of methods that growers can use to help schedule the irrigation. Soil water monitoring allows you to monitor what's in the banks of the soil. People do use weather data. The other factor that interacts with that a lot is the size of the canopy. We can measure the size of the canopy in a number of different ways. Um, we can take to it with a tape measure, right through to, to satellite imagery. Don't get collected that regularly, but the pixels in that image are quite large. So you don't only get a tree, you also get the interrow. Similarly, you can fly a drone or a UAV across an orchard. What we were interested in doing is finding a, an easy automated way of measuring canopy size. Part of this is about being able to collect that imagery and process it and generate some crop coefficients, which is really the relationship between our orchard and the general weather conditions. So the plan for the project was to ground truth, OK, how effective is the system likely to be? Roughly 40 cameras across the orchard. They're in different varieties, they're in different tree spacings, so we can understand the impact of those factors on the canopy development. That image would get collected every day, go into Swan Systems, be processed. An estimation of light interception by the canopy, and we can calculate a fairly accurate estimate of how much water that canopy is using on a particular day. Growers are busy. Irrigation is just one of the competing um, factors on their time. We're hoping that growers will see value in it and, and take it up as not necessarily their primary irrigation scheduling tool, but one of their tools that they can use. Then we will go back to our partners on systems and say, okay, look, we now have something that you can integrate into your software and can become a, a product that you could actually start selling to growers or can be part of the suite of products that you offer to growers. That extra information is invaluable in, in planning and understanding exactly what's going on.